Now, this is how you can save a downloaded PDF on your MacBook. So it kind of depends on what exactly you mean by this, because whenever you download a PDF from the internet, you can find it inside of your downloads folder of your web browser. So in Safari, you have this like download icon in your Chrome. You also have access to the downloads folder and you can easily just find it in there. And if it's downloaded, it should already be saved on your Mac, right? So if you open up the finder inside of the downloads folder, if you select the sorting by time or date added, you should be able to see the freshly downloaded file on the top of the list. So it should easily be findable right there. On the other hand, if you by this mean that you have performed some changes and you want to save those, well, if you download a PDF document, you can easily just select it, click the space bar to, to make more options show up, and then press the edit button marked by a pencil in a circle. And this will make more editing tools appear. And you can use those to add like drawings and highlight text and crop it and add shapes and whatnot. And after you are done, if you want to save those edits, just ensure to click on a done and the, this PDF will be then updated with the latest edits and information you have added in there. So it is really simple. It works kind of like this and that's how you can save it. So this is like my approach or my view of the problem of the issue. So if you have anything else, which is a bit more specific, or you have a problem that you are kind of working with, then just leave a comment below. If somebody knows the answer to you might get a comment or I might make an updated video about it. If a lot of people are struggling with the same issue, make sure to check out some other PDF videos about Mac on this channel, because I have a lot of them and you might find them helpful. So that's it. Click on the thumbs up button if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next tutorial.